came out well, no? Well, look up. The new shingles will look better once you get a little age on them. Most things do. But I saw, it wasn't just mockingbirds I saw in your thinking yesterday morning. I saw you, Elba, coming through the thicket from your rental house barefoot, wearing nothing but your nightgown. I am no one's mark. There was a hole in my roof. Mr. Brown said he could repair it. No further services are required. Well, uh, I'm glad to hear that, Eleanor, because uh, the Grovedale stalker is mowing your grass. <laughs> there were others in college. Foolish boys. One of them told me I lacked abandon. My parents taught me many things. Abandon was not among them. Now that I would argue with. Anybody who kicks figs half naked does not like abandon. <laughs> I don't know, Miss Bannister. I crossed paths with him quite a few times since he came to town. Had a nice talk with him right there at that table. Never got a sense he was up to no good. And he left the note after all. Something came up. See you later. That's not a note. That's not even a sentence. <laughs> oh, I could never be a farmer. Oh, too much uncertainty. And you like certainty. I prefer it, yes. I never found much of it around for some reason. Certainty isn't something you find, it's something you build. Like a house. Yes. Or a tomb. Eleanor Bannister, the oldest living woman in all of Texas. <laughs>